Hello everybody, welcome back to another Minecraft Let's Play video. This is episode 69 and last time we just looked around the, we just looked around. And why does it say there's monsters nearby? Are they up there? Oh, it's a drowned. Okay. It's the last time we just looked around the world. Sort of also got a crossbow, which I have, I've worked with. And now I have a lot. But that's the front of my base. This will be the back. Yeah, so I've now sort of updated my crossbow. So now it's got a lot of enchantments on it. Well, a lot of powerful ones. It did take me a while. Oh, you just try and. There we are. Hopefully I can now sleep because I haven't slept in ages. There we are. I just want to sleep before the drowns start coming. Run. Hopefully this works. And I'm running low on food, but luckily I've put an extra stack of fish in my in ender chest. And currently I'm just waiting for the for some stone to smelt because I'm today I'm gonna sort of making a better tree farm. Like 10, 20 episodes ago I made a tree farm and it's good except when I ran out of no, when I ran out of stuff and why has it stopped that's why because wow I've been sitting here for this entire time waiting for that to drop items but Oh dear, then I, I will cut it to when that's done, because I've got to the whole bunch of stuff. But yeah, I might as well show you my crossbow. So I've got piercing four, unbreaking three, quick charge three, and mending. Multi shot to me just seems a bit useless, and plus you can't have that and quick charge together. Which makes sense because I've just been overpowered. An overpowered tool. And if my shield, I have put breaking, unbreaking three and mending on it. Not sure if that would do anything, but I found an anvil and I went fishing and got a few books and had a bit of enchanting and like enchanting books and stuff. And that's what I, I got on breaking three. Like with all the books I got. And. I need to I need to deliver this trident, don't I? Because I've got I've got one there. I've got a riptide one there. I've got two riptides, so I might have to give one to someone in the world. And I apologise if I sound a bit stuffy. I think I've got a bit of a cold. Come well, I've got a blocked nose. That's all I know. I don't know if it's a cold. I guess we'll find out one day. How much do I have left? Eh, not too much. But anyway, I'm going to cut this because otherwise the entire episode just me me standing here. Waiting for that to smell. And I'll be back when that's done. Um, guys. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm back at my... I'm back at the tree farm area. It looks a little bit different when you last saw it. And I forgot to do some digging out. So now it's completely mob filled over here. I also need to collect these arrows quick, just run. Run, there we go, we're back in. Oh dear, there's a zombie right there. There's a zombie riding a zombie. <laughs> oh dear. And it's going really fast. What, it's, it's literally running. Oh dear. There we are. Anyway, we've Dug up this entire area here. It's quite large, but you can't really see the end of it. We can, but it's not quite lit up. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to light up all this. And I forgot scaffolding. Why did I put my scaffolding away? Oh dear! I put my scaffolding away, thinking oh, I don't won't actually need this, but I will. But I sort of don't because I've got blocks. Yeah, I've got to get up there, 
break as much of that. <laughs> I've pretty much broken all the ceilings and everything. So all I need to do is place in like all the glowstone. And that's pretty much it. Why am I putting stone away? I need stone. Yes, I've got a stack and 15 glowstone. That's all I've got at the minute. But I need to rearrange this glowstone. And let's quickly grab a whole bunch. Just get rid of torches for now. Grab, let's say, four and a half stacks of these. And let's make them all into slabs. Let's make quite a few. I mean, I'll definitely need more. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. This will barely touch what, I've, what I need. It's just... Yeah, this will... What I've got in my... <laughs> nine stacks would not do this. Because it's 41 blocks wide. It's 41 by 41. Meaning I need quite a lot. I need, like, what I've got at the minute. So I'm going to quick, do, like, fill in all the... All the slabs and put the glowstone in and I'll be back when I've done that because this will take a while okay so I've after several hours I have finally got the ceiling done and I made about an hour and a half it took me quite a long time to get that done because I was doing it a really weird way until right at the end when I discovered a very quick way of doing it which would take me like five minutes for like six rows so probably could take me half an hour if I'd done it like that the entire time but I've also been collecting jack-o'-lanterns and also got a bunch of resources from my storage room and there's not too much I mean I've still got the floors to do and the walls to do so I think I'm going to do the floor first just to light up you know, the room meaning I won't get any mobs in here but I mean it's a bit lighter but not light enough so I'm going to quickly do the floors and yeah I'll do the floors for the oak section actually I'll do the entire floor and I'll be right back and just like that about 15-20 minutes later I've got the oak area completed and yeah I know it's only 18 trees but they can grow about 5-6 blocks high but obviously I can just AFK here and I can just pop over here AFK at the skeleton farm get bones at the same time which just hasn't really been working that well because I've been too far away from it and then yeah I can use that bone mill to get wood for this farm so I can get more wood so really I'm getting bone mill to grow the trees and I'm getting the wood or I can just use the bone mill for other projects which is so it's a win-win situation, me building this tree farm here. And I replaced the old one that was here. Now you remember it was like a fully, it's like an automatic one, so I planted it and that, but I just had so many problems. I was like, right, this needs to go. I just thought go of the old fashioned way of just cutting trees down. Cause you can't go wrong with that. But anyway, I'm gonna quickly get on with building the birch side because we've still got so many mobs over there. Like this area blew up once. Yeah, it just blew up once and it just done quite a bit of damage. But luckily I repaired it all and everything like that. But now I need to get a lot more dirt because I'm running low. And I need a bit more birch wood, but I can make birch trees because I'll need more leaves as well. So I can just cut some trees down and sort of fix it like that. So, yeah. So I'm quick going to get on build this and get the floor done and I'll meet you when I'm done okay guys so I've just I've literally just finished the floor and it's taken me quite a long time because I had to go out get more birch wood get more birch leaves and yeah it's just looking it's looking much nicer now and it, the, the, just, the grass has got to finish spreading and this side I ran out of grass so I had to put like one or two bits of grass in each one but depending on how much I had like this one had four and these ones all had like one or two so I've just put an extra torch in there for the time being
just sort of try speed up the grass the growth of the grass like this one's nearly done so I'll take that to actually no I'll leave that there for now but this one's barely started so what I could do is take dirt from over here like all that I need that I need a bit of coarse dirt there we are keep that bit of grass in then I can replace all this with dirt there we go and then I can bring this over here to sort of speed up the growth of some of these so like if I put one there the put like one here one there one there one there it's got four more bits just this way it just speeds it up a little bit because obviously there's more grass meaning it it can grow slightly quicker which obviously the, the tick random game ticks so as you can see this one's only got two left now just in that time now it's got one bit so that'll be fine that'll grow back eventually that one's fine so now I'll start getting rid of all the torches and I think there's only two more things I need to do and one of which is building the walls and the other is putting the saplings in actually putting like growing them but I don't have to worry about bone mealing them I can just sit here in AFK like after I've recorded the episode which I'll probably do so I think next item on my list would be to put the walls in because that that'll mean I'm done that'll be, be me done for the day because I'm and yeah, it's all going very well. I've got a lot of items. I've got, I've gotten so much, especially gunpowder. Oh my goodness! Right, let's put all this random stuff away. That spider eyes, jack o' lanterns can go. With pumpkins, wherever they are, here they are. Things like gravel. Anything I've got like a single item of, that can stay. Um, in this shulker box, I'll just put coarse dirt. I'll put the andesite in there. In there's a bunch of stone, which I'm going to take out because I need a lot of stone. Like, I'll need more than this, I'd say. Actually, no, I'll, I'll need, I'll need less. Yeah, I'll need less than that. Yeah. I'll probably need what's in my inventory, plus a bit. Sp yeah, that'd be fine. Now where's the where's the ah here it is it's an empty shulk box I've got two stacks of dirt left two stacks of dirt <laughs> I, I've I've lost track of words I've been talking non-stop for well two minutes but anyway I'm gonna crack all these walls and I'll let's see when it's done okay so that was that took me the best part of five minutes to do these three walls because this one was already done if this wall was pretty much done already because yeah because this is where the room used to be and that used to be just pistons and they're just like right fill this in just so it doesn't look weird I don't get confused later so I filled that in the other day so it just left me with these and they took about two three minutes about, about a minute and a half two minutes each so it's not even that didn't take that long but all I've got to do now is run around here and just plant in all the saplings which I might as well do right now because well it's not really going to take that long like I've already done one quarter and if you're wondering why I've, this centre block isn't grown that's because I've, I've put that centre block as coarse dirt because then if someone new comes into the world it's like this used a tree farm they know where to put the sapling although it's obvious where to put the sapling I've just done that because then it doesn't grow the grasses can't grow on it meaning it's obvious where the sapling goes because you always get that one person it's like where do, where do I plant the trees and they'll fill this entire area and it'll just take forever to clear up so just by doing this it just it just makes it so much nicer 
But anyway, we've now done that. And it's looking so much nicer. Oh, and my mic is way too far away. There we go. But yeah, that is... That is this tree farm done. I'm just going to load that up quickly. Just in case I need to shoot something. I am going to get bats. That's... That's alright. Because I'm not going to be in it too often. I'm going to be in here literally just to break wood and replant it and that's pretty much it just kill that guy and there we go the first tree we've christened the new tree farm with a tree and a birch tree oh that is good news but unfortunately I'm, I am going to have to end this video here and don't worry I will I'll do the other farms off camera because they'll just it'll just be re the same thing over and over again because I've got Straight ahead's going to be the spruce and jungle, which I'll probably work on next because that's again the other one I use more. And plus, I've got loads of jungle wood and saplings which I need to use up. Well, actually, I've got hardly any jungle saplings, but I'll figure out a way. And down there's going to be acacia and dark oak, and then this side's going to be a mushroom farm. And I've already got that designed, so I'll build that. I'll build that on camera because that's. That's different, you know. That'll take me a few weeks though to get these two done. Because now I can show off sort of the build whilst building that. Which just makes sense. So I'm going to end this here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a big thumbs up and I'll see you all next time. See ya.